morning. I'm born in 75 here. I'm in the kitchen. I was trying to make some medicine, and I realized I didn't have any low-quality ginseng. So I figured I would uh, make a quick video to show you how to get some of the different flowers, like the wildflowers and the knotweed herbs and ginseng and stuff like that. So here we go. First thing we're going to do is we're going to go down by the river. Oh, let me show you where we are first. Uh, we're here on the starting island in the starting area. So we'll go down by the river and we'll get some knotweed herb. We have two fish traps here in the water. So while I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of bait in them. So for cooking recipes, you're going to need special stuff. This will be the first one. This is the knotweed herb. It's this red looking flower. So we hit it and we see it just gave us 10 of the knotweed. So knotweed, it's all over the place on the starting island by the water. Next, we'll get some peas. Uh, some of the recipes like pea paste and the pea porridge for um, heat resistance out in the desert you need. Oh, look, looks like the vagrants have been killing animals. So, um, like I said, the peas are found all over the starting area, but I tend to uh, spot them really good up on this hill. So this is where I go to get them. I like to farm stuff when I'm riding around and I see it uh, instead of waiting until I need it. I always find that the best time to grab something is when it's right in front of your face versus having to go look for it. But up here on the top of the mountain, as we ride along, if we keep looking to either side, we'll see some and they stand out quite easily. Hey, right there. Yeah. So we'll clear this bush out first. So we'll be able to see a little bit better. These small pink flowers. So those are peas. There we go. We just got 40 peas there. Here's more peas. And 20 peas there. Uh, sometimes as you're harvesting these special plants, you'll get seeds. And you can grow them in your crop plots or on the farm. And... As long as you make sure that you're having a good harvest, usually, I'm sorry, the perfect harvest, usually you'll get seeds and you can keep them going that way. So we'll go down to the kitchen, drop this stuff off, and we'll keep on keeping on. There we go. So when we need the peas and the knotweed herb, we'll have it for later. Jaw. Jaw. I'm going to try to progress in the uh, order that the material was first needed. So the next place we'll go is we'll go to look for some ginseng. All right, let's just teleport down here. Uh, right across these two bridges, I've built a couple beds. Whenever I need ginseng, I can come down here and farm it and have a little wooden chest here to store it and then I bring my horse down here and uh, pick it all up. This orange flower, this is what ginseng looks like. So you can uh, oh, just pick it up like that and look at that. We got two ginseng seeds. 
Oh, great. So this is what the low quality ginseng looks like. And here's the seeds. As you play the game, you'll remember where stuff is. And I know that there's another plant over here, so we'll come get it right quick. There we go. So that's an example of what the ginseng looks like, the little orange puffball flower. And next time I'm down here harvesting hardwood, we'll go ahead and pick it up. All these palm trees, they give hardwood and resin. Throw away sand. And stone. There we go. Moving on. Next place we'll go is, here's a starting island. We'll go up and over a little bit. And we will find some honeysuckle. Sometimes it takes a minute for the scenery to render in. So we'll just stand here. There we go. Here's the knotweed herb. Oh, I wish I had my butterfly net. There's butterflies you can see on that knotweed herb, and we need those later to make silk. But that'll be a different video. So as we come in here by this rock, this... Here, let me get a better angle. That plant is honeysuckle. There we go. Now we're having honeysuckle added. We got three. Obviously, if uh, you run around and you collect stuff with a sickle, you'll get more of it. We just got three honeysuckle, but that's okay, because we were just trying to show you all what it looks like. Next place we're going to go is up next to the desert. And, uh, Far corner, that's the desert. We have a little house here right next to it. We'll teleport here. And we will get some of the sand onions here. Not weed herb. And these pink flowers are sand onions. There, got three sand onions off that. There we go. Next, we'll go over by our saltpeter mine. I was looking to see if I left a sickle here. Does not appear so. So once again on the map, over in this area, if you are just out and about and you hit the bushes, hopefully it'll show us. I don't know if it'll work without a sickle, but this is where I come to get, yeah, there we go, the mulberry leaves.
Here's what the mulberry leaves look like. And one more thing I'll show you. I'm not showing you how to get the golden flowers because you uh, randomly get the golden flowers all over the place. Oops. There we go. These golden flowers, the wildflowers, you can get all over the place. Same thing with the flax, the low quality flax. Um, I've seen seeds for the low quality flax that you can farm, not the golden, golden wildflowers, but that's okay because they are all over the place. Last thing I want to see is down here by the swamp. <clears throat> we were down here hunting alligators the other day. I'm sorry, crocodiles. So weird when stuff hasn't rendered in. Oh, you can see the crocodiles over there. We will still stay well away from them for right now. But down the road over here on the right hand side is the last thing I want to show you. This, this stone, I don't have a hammer with me, but that gives you what's called Relegar. And you need that for a few of the recipes. These stones, Relegar, that's copper. But it's down by the swamp. And when you're running out and about, you can find it pretty easy. Right. Uh, hope that helps, and now you have an idea of what some of the special flowers and ingredients for recipes look like. <laughs> Take care.